Okay. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and good morning. So first, uh, we will discuss your practice, your homework. We start with self-practice 1.4. Number 2D. Number 2D. Given fx equal to x minus 5 and gx equal to uh, 1 over x minus 1 and x cannot equal to 1. Okay, class here. Before I uh, do the solution, you need to know uh, where we get x is not equal to 1. This uh, unequal, this e equation you get from the denominator. Okay, the denominator for fraction cannot equal to 1. x minus 1, uh, sorry, cannot equal to 0. x minus 1 cannot equal to 0. If you use calculator 1 over 0, you will not get any value. Okay, maths error. So, denominator cannot equal to 0. So, x is not equal to 1. Let's see the denominator uh, 1 over 2x minus 3. So, what is the properties of this fraction? 2x minus 3 is not equal to 0. So, x is not equal. 3 bring to the right hand side. This is 2x. Then bring to the right hand side become division. Multiplication become division. So, the properties of this fraction x cannot equal to 3 over 2. Okay, before because if we substitute x with 3 over 2, the denominator will become 0. Denominator cannot equal to 0. Okay, that is the reason where we get this. Next, uh, the question asks you for each pair of the function below, obtain an expression in the form of function notation for fg. Uh, g f f squared and g squared. Okay. F g. Ni semua ke masalah ke hanya beberapa bahagian saja? Semua ke? Awak boleh pin pada nama saya eh, yang setengah saya menulis ni. Awak boleh pin. Ada tiga titik di situ. Ada ada tanda pin di situ. Gambar pin. Boleh pin kan pada gambar saya. Pada ni. Screen ni. Okay. Semua. Kena bincang semua. FG. FG. So FGX means function G inside. Function G inside. Okay. <clears throat> Function G inside, so we copy F. Function g is 1 over x minus 1. Now, function fx equal to x minus 5. x we change to 1 over x minus 1. So, x we change to x minus 1. So, I substitute x with 1 over x minus 1 minus 5. Okay, this is fraction. This is fraction, minus 5. So, this is minus 5 over 1. Make the denominator same, we multiply with x minus 1. And here we multiply x minus 1. Okay, so this is 1 minus 
5 x minus 1 over x minus 1. 1 minus 5 x, we expand. Then we plus 5 over x minus 1. So final answer 6. 1 plus 5, 6 minus 5 x over x minus 1. Okay, that is FG. And the properties of this fraction, x cannot equal to 1. Uh, next, GF, GF, GFX mean function F inside, function F inside function G. So we copy G. What is function f? Function f is x minus 5. x minus 5. Okay, just now, function g x equal to 1 over x minus 1. So now we don't want x. We want x minus 5. So 1 over x, we change to x minus 5. Minus 1. So, final answer, 1 over x minus 6. So, what is the properties of this function? x cannot equal to 6. Because x minus 6 equal to 0, it's not equal to 0. So, x equal to 6. Next, f, f squared. Now, f, f, x. This is f f x. Function f x equal to x minus 5. So now this is function f inside function f. So we copy f. Okay. And f x is x minus 5. We want, this is x. We don't want x. We want x minus 5. So this x, we change to x minus 5. So x minus 10. Yang ini tak ada syarat sebab dia bukan denominator. Denominator sahaja kita tulis syarat dia. Next. Okay. G, G, X. G, 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 X. So this is function G inside function G. So we copy G, the first G, and G, X is 1 over X minus 1. Okay. Just now, G, X equal to 1 over X minus 1. We want to change X. Okay. X become 1 over X minus 1. So here also we change, x also we change to 1 over, okay, this is 1 over, x we change to 1 over x minus 1 minus 1, minus 1 from here. Okay, x we change to this uh, function. Next, how to solve? This is fraction, minus 1. So 1 we change to fraction, this is over 1. Multiply with x minus 1. Multiply with x minus 1. So the answer. Next step. One over. Okay. This is one. Uh, over x minus 1 minus 1 over x minus 1. Sorry, this is x minus 1. So, I combine. Okay, be careful class. When minus with some term, some uh, function, make sure you 
do the bracket. You write the bracket. So 1 minus x minus 1 over x minus 1. This is 1 divide. Okay. 1 minus x minus minus become plus 1. Over x minus 1. Saya tukar. Tadi saya buat per. Tapi saya tukar jadi bahagi. Per dengan bahagi sama. So yang ini saya salin. Okay. So this is 1 divide. 1 plus 1, 2 minus x over x minus 1. So divide with fraction become multiplication. Okay, divide with fraction become multiplication and this is x minus 1 over 2 minus x. Okay, so final answer, okay, this is multiply with 1. We'll get x minus 1 over 2 minus x. What is the value here? x cannot be? Cannot equal to? 2. Yes, two. very good. Cannot equal to 2. Okay. X minus 1 over 2 minus x and x cannot equal to 2. If we substitute x with 2, 2 minus 2 become 0. So denominator become 0. Cannot. Denominator cannot equal to 0. This is the final answer. Next, number 4. Given that fx equal to ax plus b and f squared x equal to 4x minus 9. Find the value of constant a and b. So what is the value of a and b? Class, uh, kalau soalan macam ni, mesti awak kena tahu dia mesti melibatkan comparison, perbandingan. Okay. Sekarang fx yang diberi fx dengan ffx. Jadi yang ini soalan beri ffx. Kita boleh bina ffx using this information. Okay. So we want to find ffx. This is ffx. Ini yang soalan beri. Kita nak cari perkara yang sama dengan soalan. So kita bina sendiri ffx. So this is f inside f. So we copy the first f and fx is ax plus b. Okay, then fx equal to ax plus b. Now we don't want x, we change x. The terms x we will change. So become a we copy, a, a we copy, we change x. x become ax plus b. Okay, n plus b. So this is equal to a squared x plus a b plus b. I expand. a squared x plus a b plus b. This is from our solution. From question, this is equal to 4x minus 9. Now, we do comparison because x and x. And here, we do comparison. Okay. x with x. So, a squared equal to 4. a squared equal to 4. So, how to get a? Sorry. How to get a? This is square. So, you, we do square root. Square root have plus and minus. Okay, square root we have two answers, plus and minus. So a will become plus minus two, or you can write a equal to two and one more negative two. Now we do for the constant a b plus b equal to negative nine. We do comparison. This is positive, so no need to write positive. A, B plus B equal to negative 9. If A equal to 2, okay, if A equal to 2, I substitute, this is 2B plus B 
equal to negative 9. So 3B equal to negative 9. B equal to negative 3. This is for A equal to 2. If A equal to negative 2, we need to do both because we have two answers for A. So when A equal to negative 2, I substitute into this function. So this equation. So negative 2B plus B, negative 2B plus B equal to negative 9. A, I substitute with negative 2. So become negative B equal to negative 9. So B equal to 9. Therefore, final answer, A equal to 2 and B equal to negative 3. And one more, when A equal to negative 2, B equal to 9. Okay, you give final answer like this. No need to do hashtag, no need to do triple dot, no need to write, uh, to to draw double line. Okay, this is your final answer. Buat macam ni saja jawapan akhir. Jangan buat triple dot ke, uh, tak nak. Okay, boleh faham? Boleh faham, Encik. Rasa ni eh. Ada soalan nak tanya? Uh, soalan... I don't think so, so far. Okay, good. Next, so 1.5. Self practice, 1.5. Number 1A. Given two function. Okay. Fx equal to 2x plus 1. And gx equal to x over x minus 1. And x is not equal to 1. Find fg3. Okay, inside this composite function, okay, inside function is g3. So, we solve g3 first, g3. So, this is 3. x we substitute with 3 over 3 minus 1. So, this is 3 over 2. So, fg3 now, we can write f3 over 2. Because g3, we get 3 over 2. Yeah. Okay. So, now, fx is 2x plus 1. We don't want, uh, we don't want x. We want 3 over 2. So, x we change to 3 over X here also we change to 3 over 2. So 2 multiply 3 over 2. Okay, 2 multiply 3 over 2 plus 1. This is uh, 3 plus 1 equal to 4. So this is the final answer. Uh, Chigu, mm -hmm. uh, can I ask, because the way that I did it is different. Because I did it, how I did it was I made the composite function first and then I substituted 3 can, into can. it. Also That's can. also can. Uh, ah, yes, okay. can. Okay. Tapi panjang you. sikit kan? Cara dia tu ah, yeah, panjang yeah, yeah. sikit kan? This one is uh, a lot simpler, yeah. Okay. Okay, never mind. Uh. Okay, next. For C. One C. F X equal to uh, X plus one over X minus three, and X cannot equal to three. And G X equal to six over X minus two, and X cannot equal to two. Find F. 2, 4, and g squared 1 over 2. Okay. Now, I solve f first. f squared 4. This is f, f, 4. So, we find f, 4 first. Because f, 4 is inside function. It's the inside function. This is f, 4. So, we solve this first. Okay. f, 4 equal to 
fx is x plus 1 over x minus 3. We don't want x. We don't want x. So we change x with 4. 4 plus 1 over 4 minus 3. 4 plus 1 over 4 minus 3. So this is 5 over 2. So now f f4 just now. Okay. This is equal. Okay. This is equal to f4 we get. 5 over 2. Okay, 5 over 2. So, we substitute into function f. Kita gantikan dalam function f. 5 over 2 plus 1. Okay, kita dah tak nak x. Ni, kita tak nak x dah. Kita nak ganti x ini dengan 5 over 2. So, 5 over 2 plus 1 over, yang ni pun, 5 over 2 minus 3. 5 over 2 minus 3. Okay, so 1 by 1, uh, numerator, uh, 5 over 2 plus 1, you get 7 over 2. Over 5 over 2 minus 3, you get negative 1 over 2. Okay, so here you can write 7 over 2 divided by negative 1 over 2. When divide become multiplication, so multiply uh, negative. Teacher. Huh? Uh, teacher, there's an error. 4 minus 3 equals to 1, teacher. You wrote 4 minus two. 3. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 1. F4, right? Oh, so, kena buat lain lah ni. Dah jadi salah dah. So, 1C, uh, X plus 1, X minus 3, and X cannot equal to 3. Uh, GX, uh, 6 over X minus 2. X cannot equal to 2. So, kita nak F24 and G21 over 2. So, saya buat F24 dulu. So, this is 4F, F4. So, I solve F4. So, F4. We don't want X. We don't want X. We don't want X. We change to 4. So, 4 plus 1 over 4 minus 3. So, this is 5 over 1. This is equal to 5. Okay. Next. F, F4 is equal to F. F4 equal to F5. So, 5 plus 1 over 5 minus 3. The answer is 6 over 2. Final answer 3. Correct? Yeah. Okay, next. G, G, 1 over 2. This is G, G, 1 over 2. So, we solve G1 over 2. We solve G1 over 2. Using function G. Okay, function G just now. Gx equal to 6 over x minus 2. So, we don't want x. Now, we want to use 1 over 2. So, 6 over 1 over 2 minus 2. So, 1 over 2 minus 2. Then 6 divide answer, you get negative 4. Okay. Now. Cikgu yang ke bawah tu tak boleh lihat. Sorry. Oh, ah, okay. Thank you. Ah, thank you. So, GG 1 over 2. This is G. G 1 over 2 just now we get negative 4, right? Yeah. So, we write negative Then we substitute into function G, 6 over negative 4 minus 2, answer negative 1. Okay. Okay, Julia. Okay, next, D.
20. fx equal to x square minus 4. gx equal to 2 over x minus 2. And x cannot equal to 2. Fine. F, F negative 1 and G, G 1. So we solve F first. F, F, F negative 1. So I solve F negative 1 first. This is F negative 1 first. So F negative 1. X we change to negative 1. X we change to negative 1. So negative 1 squared plus 4 and here mm. negative squared is uh, 1 plus 4, 5. So just now we want f, f negative 1. f negative 1 we get 5. We copy. f this is 5 we get from here. Okay. So f 5 5 squared minus 4 Final answer, 25 minus 4, answer 21. Next, G, G, 1. G, G, 1. So, we solve G, 1 first. So, G, 1 first. G, 1. Uh, excuse me, teacher. Uh, teacher. There yes. is another error. It's x minus 4. You wrote x plus 4, really. Oh, yeah. x minus 4. Oh, so yeah. this uh, is uh, 1 minus 4, negative 3. 3. Thank you. So here is negative 3. Negative 3. And here should be 9 minus 4. Answer is 5, correct? Ah, yeah. Answer is 5. Good. Thank you. Wow. Okay, next, G1, G1, we use function G, we use function G. This is X, we don't want X, we substitute with 1. So 2 over 1 minus 2, so 2 over 1 minus 2 is negative 1, so this is negative 2. So just now, the original function, the original question is G, G1, but G1 we get, just now is negative 2. So this is G negative 2. So we use function G. Function G. So 2 over X. We want negative 2. Negative 2 minus 2. So 2 over negative 4. Answer negative 1 over 2. Class. Uh, careful with negative symbol. Okay. Negative tak boleh letak di bawah. Final answer kena letak di tengah atau atas sahaja. Tak boleh letak di bawah. Oh. Kalau letak bawah, salah eh. Salah, okey. Ya. Yeah. Okey, selesai 1D. Boleh faham self-practice 1.5? Uh, dah boleh faham tu. Thank you. Okay, good. Uh, next, 1.6. Cikgu, kita boleh kan you expand dulu baru boleh masuk yang nombor tu kan? Boleh kan cikgu? Boleh. Maknanya you buat composite function dulu, dulu kan? Dulu. Ah. ah, boleh, boleh. Okay, Tapi mungkin uh, sometimes dia akan jadi panjang lah. Ah, ya cikgu, panjang. <laughs> oh, kelas mana ada fizik? Tu saya tanya dalam group tadi. ST2 kot. Hmm. Okay, uh, ST2 boleh ni dulu Keluar dulu Nanti maknanya saya tak boleh cepatkan kelas pukul 10 lah Saya akan start semula pukul 10 Tapi untuk yang dua soalan yang baki ni 1.6 ni saya bincang terus sekarang boleh Lepas tu uh, tek, uh, kita rest 10 kita sambung new subtopic uh, New example boleh lah cikgu. Rasanya. Okay. So yang ST tu boleh uh, keluar dulu masuk kelas fizik dulu.
Okay, so now self practice 1.6. One B. Okay, f x equal to x square plus one, and f g x equal to x square plus four x plus five. Given the function f and the composite function f g, so determine the function g for each of the following. We want g, di dalam, function dalam. We want G. Function yang di dalam. Kalau function luar, let. Okay, we use let. Ini function yang di dalam. So, function di dalam, maknanya macam tadi. Saya kata Nmax mesti tak lari dengan comparison. Ini soalan beri. Kita kena bina yang kita punya. Okay, so X with X. Ini kita tukar kepada GX. X ini kita tukar kepada GX. So ini akan jadi GX squared. Okay sebab X ini kita tukar kepada GX. Plus 1. So ini FGX yang kita cari. This is uh, GX squared plus 1. Yang ini FGX yang soalan beri. Kalau macam tadi kita cari bila X squared dia sama, kita cari dia punya coefficient dia mesti sama. Ha, tapi ini comparison dia lain pula. Comparison dia dia akan jadi GX squared plus 1 equal to X squared plus 4X plus 5. Sebab both function are same. So, left hand side equal to right hand side. So, we want GX. So, we bring 1 to the right. So, become X square plus 4 X plus 4. Now, the, case, the function square. We don't want square. We want only GX. This is self practice uh, 1.6, number 1B. We want GX only. So we do square root. Okay, how to square root? Actually, this uh, quadratic expression, you can do factorization. X squared. Okay, x squared, 2 multiply 2 multiply x, 4x, okay, 2 squared means 4. Okay, I expand here, x squared, 2 multiply 2 multiply x is 4x, 2 squared is 4. So, square root and square, final answer will get x plus 2. Understand class? Cikgu, yang saya buat cikgu, saya tak factorize langsung. Saya hanya square root x square plus 4 x plus 4. And then I got uh, x plus 2 times the square root of x plus 2. Yang tu salah kan? Uh, dia, uh, final answer dia mesti akan jadi macam ni. Uh, okay. You mesti kena guna factorization. Kena guna factorization lah. Uh, okay cikgu, faham. Next, last question, 3B. Given the function hx equal to 8 over x and x, the properties of function x cannot equal to 0 and hgx equal to 4x. 3B, find the value of x. What is the value of x? When g h x equal to 6. Okay. Now, from part A, you know the function g x, right? Okay, say buatlah. Tak apa. h x equal to 8 over x. 
we want x we change to gx okay x we change to gx so here become x over gx okay this is equal to x over gx this is equal to 4x so saya tukar tempat so gx equal to x over 4x so gx equal to 2 over x and x cannot equal to 0 ah yang ni yang you dapat dari a okey yang kawan tanya a uh, b so b ghx okey yang ini dia beri tapi kita tak ada so kita kena buat ghx so ghx G H X G we copy so H X is H X is X over X okay from part A from uh, part A G X G X we get two over X but now X become sorry x become x over x. So, g x over x equal to 2 over, this is x over x. And here is 2 divided by x over x. So, 2 multiply x over a. Okay, this is x over 4. This is g h x. Cikgu jawapan final B ialah 24. Belum habis lagi. Oh. Kita baru cari uh, GHX. Oh ya. Yeah. Uh, ini soalan right. ini yang kita dapat hmm. kan? Yeah, yang yeah. soalan beri GHX equal to 6 right? Ah, uh, yang ini yang right. kita buat comparison. Ah, X okay, over okay. 4 equal to 6. So X equal to 6 multiply 4, 20. 24. Uh. No uh, okay, okay. Dia dalam admax kan Apa-apa soalan biasanya Kalau melibatkan two unknown Ataupun two uh, Two unknown Biasanya two unknown uh, Dia akan menggunakan uh, Comparison Two unknown, two function uh, Dia akan melibatkan comparison Comparison tu macam mana Dekat soalan dia beri okay, Dia dah beri pada soalan so, before you compare, you need to do your own. Maknanya sebelum you buat comparison, you mesti cari yang you punya sendiri. So, ini soalan. So, yang you punya GHX, yang ini tadi yang kita buat panjang-panjang. Yang ini. Okay. Kemudian, baru kita boleh buat comparison. So, X over 4 equal to 6. So, X equal to 24. Ini yang kita punya. Ini yang kita punya. Ini dari question. So, mesti buat comparison. Ini pun namanya comparison juga. Kalau macam tadi yang cari A, itu pun comparison juga. Sama. Ha, ni. Ni tadi. Ini pun comparison juga. Cuma comparison dia X, X. So, nak cari ini. So, coefficient equal to coefficient. Yang ini pun AB plus B equal to negative 9. Ha, ini pun namanya comparison. Okay. Ya ini pun namanya comparison. So dalam NMAX banyaknya melibatkan comparison. Yang soalan beri dengan yang you cari. So you comparekan dua jawapan tu. Boleh? Boleh cikgu. Yeah, thank you. Uh, okay. Uh, kita selesai our discussion. So uh, 10 o'clock we will continue for example 11. And inverse function. Okay. So, thank you class. Okay, thank you teacher. Thank you teacher. Thank you.